this is Kalies von Kreatives Leben and today I am uh, going to create an art journal uh, with you and a very specific spe special art journal. It's a journey um, uh, art journal and uh, because this is doing two things I really like. I love art journals, I love traveling and um, I will show you how I'm doing it. So basically, before I leave, I prepare all my pages. And I was leaving for um, four days. So I prepared um, eight pages, two pages per day, actually even four because it's two-sided. And I am trying to do both sides. And um, you saw me at the beginning. I had like five color swatches. And... The way I chose these colors was I used I, I looked at different uh, pictures from Marrakesh. So this is the, 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 the place I visited in those four days. And um, with an app called uh, Pantone Studio, I, I look at the key colors and basically five colors came out. And these are the five colors. I have tried to use throughout my uh, travel journal. So uh, it's a dark blue. It's it's a very a light blue, not not a very light blue, a, a ultra marine blue and um, uh, greenish and and yellow ochre and etc. So uh, I have been. Um, using uh, only these colors and I also took only these colors with me when I left. Um, what you can see is I just um, took whatever had the same color, so um, stamps and um, uh, stencil, so, so whatever uh, came to my mind and I just, you know, carried away and the objective was to create a background which would make it easier for me to continue on and basically um, during my holiday I don't I usually um, do watercolors and I um, use uh, little pictures uh, photographies that I take with my mobile I print them out so um, what I'm doing is creating a background mostly for my pictures and for my memorabilia that I will be collecting throughout my travel. And then I also create other pages with less paint where I just have probably, um, you know, some, some stamp or, or some watercolor stenciling and more subtle. This, these are the pages I will use for my painting. So I have two kinds of of. Uh, pages that I created and um, this uh, travel journal is quite different to travel journals I've been doing uh, in, in, in other videos this time I decided to use a cigarillo uh, box a uh, cigar box uh, actually I should have used it for a travel to Cuba but I don't have this in my I haven't any plans done set up yet, so uh, I'm basically taking this uh, cigar box and and using the same stencils, the same uh, paints, the same colors, and trying to. Uh, I I chose the box for two reasons. I really like the fact that I can use it to put memorabilia. So whatever I will be collecting throughout my travel, I can put it in my little box. That's one thing. And the other thing is it had the same size than my travel journal. So another plus. Um, and it, it would protect everything. So this is why I'm using this as my little uh, travel journal. Um, I could have... Um, um, sticked it or, or glue it, glued it to my box, but I decided to have these independently of each other. And as you can see, you know, I'm I'm just uh, stamping away and covering everything up and uh, having fun mostly. Um, you know, I don't want to have the 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 scan code here, and so that's why I'm trying to go over everything and and creating like a, a pattern. Which will which uh, you also find on on the pages. So it all belongs in one, and um, this is something I I really liked. Um, what 
was also important is the way I'm going to bind my uh, travel journal. Um, I'm using some little clips and you will see what I do at the end to make sure it's really like a, um, a good, a good or easy, easy to do uh, binding and also very stable. So here I'm using my Delusion paints, still tr struggling with these. These are older ones. Um, they say they have changed the um, composition because it's it's just very, I, I don't know. I, I don't like how they transform. It's, it's really a pain. Here you see me using my pencil because I want to find the middle to put this little rosette. Obviously, um, I chose my uh, stencils based on what I expected to find in Marrakesh, which is known for, you know, lots of uh, very oriental um, designs and, and uh, ceramics and be beautiful, beautiful um, uh, mosaics. So this is what I'm trying to replicate here on my little box. And um, I'm going to cover up uh, uh, Habana because I don't want people to see about it. it's not really it's not the right country right it's it's so uh, that's something i need to change um and uh, uh what i also have taken with me so when i i created or what i took with me on my travel was basically pencils watercolors um, a, a brush. I don't like water brushes. I take proper brush. So I have a travel brush and I have a little um, cup with me, a plastic cup, which is very convenient. It's a it's a children's cup, actually. So to uh, and avoid splitting, but that makes it easier also for me. And then um, so I didn't take any stamps or stencils. I took some um, yeah, some tickets, some stickers, some, you know, whatever I found in my stash that I felt would fit in well. And now as my next step, I'm showing you uh, on my return or every evening when I came back uh, to the hotel, I basically uh, printed out my favorite pictures and I have a little printer with me to um to uh, print from my iPhone. And then um, these are uh, pictures that are stickers and I really like them. And these stickers are really great because, you know, for example, here I realized that I wanted to have the ticket in the back so I can take my uh, picture off, put the, uh, the ticket in the back first, and then that's it. And basically, um, you know, I play with what I have and what makes fun. So, for example, this painting, I felt this picture didn't go well there. I felt that I needed something different. I really love this African woman. I know that Marrakesh is not really Black Africa, so the the, the but you could see some some people from Senegal or Mali. You know, people from from the borders coming there, and. Um, here you see, so these, the first one were my uh, ac acrylic paint uh, uh, papers and, and pages. And now this is where I do my watercolor. So these I have less paint on. And I um, usually think about one of the pictures that I took during the day that I f feel would go well there. And here you can see a stalk. And I really... Uh, enjoyed what I discovered in Marrakesh is I come from a, a place in Germany where we have many stalks in summer and they disappear in winter and I found them now they are in Marrakesh and the very funny thing is I found many of them usually in, in, where I'm I'm staying we have a couple we just have two um, you know in a net a nest and here uh, I think I saw 20 uh, on a runes and um, of a palace and and wonderful i really really enjoyed that very funny and uh you know they were just standing there uh, enjoying the sun enjoying the heat and probably thinking oh i have to go back to <laughs> to berlin uh in next spring so um i like really like that and one fun thing about the watercolor in marrakesh was it's a very dry and very hot weather so it's really great for watercolors everything uh dries very fast and here i'm drawing my little stalks and giving them um you know playing around also with uh 
color pencil. So these are the things that I have with me usually. I have my um, uh, carbon ink uh, pen. I have my uh, um, the Prismacolor, and I think uh, Caron Dash also. So it's a mixture of different color pencils that I uh, I'm using. Uh, I also stick to the colors that I had identified at the beginning. I felt that that was important. And now I'm showing you what I'm doing. So here I'm doing my clips. I position them, moving them around until I'm happy. And once I'm done, I take off the little legs, as you can see. And that's basically the easiest way to do a little um, travel journal. You know, no binding, um, no threads. You just take them off and here you are. So I'm going to um, put it to, to um, yeah, I was thinking of, of uh, adding something. So I'm going to put it in my box and I'm going to do a flip through so that you see how this looks like. I really enjoyed it. It's a mixture of homemade and pictures and it's a great memory of my little travel to 